This short video has been made to aid with the correct assembly and startup procedures for the range of Draper diesel space heaters. Every heater comes with an instruction manual that should be read before assembly and first use. Before beginning to assemble, check you have all of the correct components. You should now take the axle and fit it to the base frame, followed by each wheel in turn before sitting the main heater body onto the frame ensuring the bolt holes line up. Next, take the first part of the handle frame, put into position and bolt into place with the supplied bolts, washers and locking nuts. Once secure, take the second part of the handle frame and repeat the previous procedure. Check the internal diesel filter is in place before using a funnel with a filter to fill the fuel tank. Note the fuel tank must be completely full before first use. Once full, replace the fuel cap securely. Always make sure there are no combustible or flammable materials in the surrounding area and that it is well ventilated and the area at the front and rear of the heater is clear and will allow adequate airflow as per the instruction manual. You can now plug into a 13 amp power supply and turn on, then by pushing the red button on the heater. The heater will run a diagnostic process before starting. If fitted with an adjustable thermostat, you can adjust by pressing the up and down arrows. To turn it off, always use the red button on the machine, allowing the fan to keep running for approximately two minutes. If, when you turn on your heater, you get an intermittent bleeping and an error code is displayed, you should consult the manual. Never attempt to adjust or dismantle your heater. This could cause danger, resulting in injury or risk to life, and will invalidate the machine warranty.